This family is worth $500 billion. They are the Rothschilds. Some conspiracies claim they actually control all of the major banking around the world. Some even say they've decided the outcome of global wars. How about the Kennedys, the Bushes, the Fords, the Carnegies? These aren't just families. By now, they're institutions. For periods of time, they've held the puppet strings that move the masses. Granted, some of them use this power for good, while others, like the Sacklers, not so much. But how do they get so powerful? Simple. At some point, they learned the secret of power. And this is it. The man-made world is built on lies. Clever lies can start wars, swindle fortunes, or sway elections. So your status in life depends on how well you maneuver around deception. Sadly, the masses have horrible judgment. Wherever the crowd goes, run the other direction. For all is wrong. Three centuries they're wrong, and they will always be wrong. Wisdom is doing everything the crowd does not do. All you do is reverse the totality of their learning, and you have the heaven they're looking for. So even just avoiding the crowd gives you more status and wealth. Because those in power keep the masses distracted. So that they don't have the time to learn what the truth is. So they don't ever get smart enough to learn how they're being manipulated. So they don't ever question the emperor. That's why they pay. A player on a football team or a baseball team a million or two million or three million dollars a year. It is the Roman circus. Plato said society is like a cave, where rulers keep people trapped by projecting shadows on the cave walls. Due to fear, the people never learn about life outside the walls. The world outside the cave is a life of true wealth, health, and freedom. It's what you've been craving all your life without realizing it. It's the path to your best self. But he says there's a way out of the cave if you can learn to ignore the shadows. This is where you come in. You, like me, are in that metaphorical cave. And until now, you didn't know it. You've been following society's blueprint. You have a job and do everything your boss says. You are nice, hoping others will respond in kind. You eat how TV suggests. But the results aren't matching the effort why? I'll tell you why. You're following someone else's compass instead of your own. So your efforts are actually taking you farther away from success. And that's the problem. You're doing too much, and you're doing the wrong things. You're falling for the shadows on the wall. You see, the masses make decisions based on what they see and hear, so they're easily fooled by the shadows. But the rich hone their ability to feel their way through tough terrain thus avoiding traps. The rich have a rich instinct. You and I level up by re-sparking this instinct. And the first spark is courage. Courage to push past our fears and into a special form of action. Because we can only gain what we're willing to lose. You want money? Bet what you have on yourself or your business. You want status? Accept the ridicule that comes from being different. In other words, you are what you risk. The rich and powerful get to be rich and powerful because of their philosophy, their mental operating system, if you will. It's an intense realism that lets them take in the world around them as it really is, without the distractions and vices that block most from reality. This starts a domino effect. One good step clears the way for a better follow-up step. And so the gains multiply. But you won't get there playing it safe. The modern world pushes us to crave safety. It domesticates us. But it's a paradox, because this craving for safety kills our natural instinct. And this instinct is the only thing that can lead us to money, freedom, and status. Ultimately, life must be risky, because no one is making it out alive. Only by risking the safety of the cave can we gain the riches waiting outside of it. Rich Instinct is a book about how to gain wealth and power in this deceitful world. 
Get it on Amazon, Audible, Apple Books, Google Play, and all other major platforms.